said, let me introduce myself at first. I'm Hidenori Suzuki, representative director and president of NTT Delta MSC from 2015. <coughs> Prior to current position, I was engaged in the creation of cutting edge service in telecom business B and played an important role in worldwide business development. In current position, I have promoted full-scale entry in the automotive field and now I'm leading the expansion of business field in automotive, IoT and product. This is our company's brief profile. We NTT Delta MSC at the headquarters located at Shin Yokohama in Japan. We have two subsidiaries. They are NTT Delta MSC Dalian in China at the offshore site and CATS as a development tool supplier. Our main business is to develop embedded software for the field of automotive, IoT, and product. As you can see in the figure of shareholders, MSC was 100% subsidiary of Panasonic Previous <coughs> as a mobile embedded software company. And in 2008, we joined in NTT Data Group. After joining NTT Data Group, our business has expanded IoT and automotive field. From 2016, we have three shareholders, including Denso. Our sale revenue is shown on the right side on the bottom. Automotive takes the biggest volume uh, of our uh, revenue, and this is the field we most concentrate on at the moment. In 2014, automotive field, we have a wide range of business by using our knowledge and technical skills of IoT cloud embedded. Among these business, the area we, where we have most advantages in vehicle devices such as meta cluster, in vehicle information and connectivity. Our achievement and engagement in vehicle device de development are shown in this slide. For meta cluster, we have the development display functionality such as HMI or Parachute Display. And for IQI system, navigation, audio, and tissue DCM development using the skills of mobile device development are our achievement. Regarding connectivity, we have implemented Android Auto, CarPlay, and Miracast. Our next step of our connectivity is smart device link. And our demo system is now showcased at our booth today. So please visit us when you have a time. Every day we are driving our activities with our engagement and spirits like this to contribute to an automotive industry. From this slide, I would like to talk about the importance of data utilization in the connected car era. What is a connected, connected car? In past, the car had evolved as a stand-alone device. But recently, the car has been changed to device which can be used inside the network according to the evolution of controlling the computers and mobile network. We can this type of car, 
which has a capability to get the service from the network as a connected card. In the world of the connected card, it is able to con collaborate with the IT backend of OEMs and service providers. As a result, various data surrounding the card will fuse together and make it possible to realize not only the service of the drivers, but more new variable services. In other words, how to collect data from CAP and how to use data for the services is very important for the connected CAP. There are three major points in data cycle of the connected CAP. First is sense. Various sense data generated from sensors in CAP. For example, people's status, surrounding development status, or driver's condition. Secondly, the change to the generated data to information and, and the value of intelligence. Third is to take action according to the information with intelligence. Out of this point, I'd like to focus on information and, and intelligence. Keyword of information are three V. Variety, volume, velocity. I'd like to de describe two points of consider the software of these three V. Let's start from variety. We can collect various data from the car. As a whole, car data. We can get the driving data, the condition of each car parts, and the information around the car. And human data. We can get operations history, attribute of drivers or passengers, and biological data. We can also get the traffic information, map information, and uh, other cards information and society data. The important point is the relationship of each data. For example, if combination of data like driver's high heart rate beat with sudden speed dropping at the specific crossroad is correct so often, then we can assume that the crossroad has some safety issue. This kind of various information can be used not only for personalized services. It will be possible to offer new value to consumers with big data analysis. To realize this, it is important to build a system to handle different attributes of the data seamlessly to others and the societal them together. Second, it's volume. Variety of data are not only provided by only one car. When the number of connected car increases, then the amount of data is kept, sending and receiving over the network. This graph shows the prediction of quantity of connected car which ship in the world market. You can see the rapid growth from 2020 to 2035. In 2035, it is expected that volume in image data, such as camera or LiDAR, will increase. So that total amount of the communication data from all peoples is predicted to be approximately 3.0 is divided per year, which is a hundred times bigger than in of 2025. For this amount of data, it is important to process with the consideration of purpose and type of use. Network design with high efficient data process is necessary, with consideration of data volume, communication performance, and responsibility. Last one is velocity. To manage and control the car, each of the information needed to the process and providing the proper time. 
So we think important to spread the process according to the characteristics to process data efficiency, efficiently to realize it. <laughs> Client waste issue takes a role to process data inside the car. Data process is finished with a few seconds or needs to be done without network connection. Such as autonomous driving should be done at client side. Edge takes a role to process data which are only used in the division card and master process prefer. Especially the information which is difficult to process in the client side due to processing capability or a need to use accumulated data should be handled to that edge side. Cloud takes the role of process data collected from the number of car. Cloud side takes and take a hand in case to generate and process value information even if data sometimes, for example, the traffic data from cars. To build effective and efficient network, I think that the architecture design is very important. I have uh, explained all important three ways for information gap, but to use the information for each drivers and cars. The session of moving cars keep changing the movement. And there is a difference in driving technique and likes and taste for each driver. So it's necessary to drive services or driving control information between to the driver. To realize this, AI will take an important role. There are two AI methodologies which is important to use for the car. One thing is a machine learning AI, which raises a maturity with deep learning and judges from the past experience. The other thing is rule based AI, which judges from data registered or configured in advance. These AI methods need to be allied, allied to private services. Let's think about a few examples of the service using AI to control the behavior of on car like an accident avoidance or a crisis prevention. All of the car need to be controlled according to the same rule. In this case, it is appropriate to apply to based AI for safety car control. And it will become possible to set the suitable driving route by making AI learning the driving the data with machine learning. If there are any crossroad or routes when sudden braking open focus, then it can set the driving route excluding that point. If AI learning the learn the prevents of data a driver, then it can set the driving route which the driving route compatible. As you can see, it is necessary to apply and combine suitable AI methodologies for each purpose to realize safety and comfortable traffic control. <coughs> but further discussion is necessary to determine which combination is reasonable as an automotive industry. For well, the next generation of the connected car services, we assume that various information which is collected from the connected car will not be limited to services of the car, such as comfortable in car environment or safety driving support like ADAS or autonomous driving. For example, it is expected to use following cases. Provide autonomous driving control to examine the usage of traffic lanes, 
and to realize the efficiency. Realize effective load maintenance and condition management by using load condition information collected from driving car. Contribute build safety and security, such as priority control of emergency vehicle or emission avoidance to residential road. But <coughs> believe that the evolution of the collected car is surely contribute to improve the society infrastructure. But the evolution of the collected car there are still many issues and obstacles to overcome in each factor. To overcome, we think that each field of ground, age, and client need to be evolved with aligned steps, ensuring quality and security. From that point of view, Relax can be applied to all fields and involved with aligned steps. In order to build the relax world to realize self evolutions, we believe the power of the relax communication is necessary and we expect it also. Relax, which is the most popular OS for the server and cloud and agile which make a breakthrough as an income platform. We would like to go forward to expand from relaxing the car to relax over the automotive society with combination of these. LTT Data MSE will contribute to realize the world with our full knowledge accumulated in the income